In DaVinci Resolve's Fusion, an instance is a copy of a node that copies all behaviour from the original as changes are made. When using nodes in Fusion, you'll often find that you want to have the same node in multiple places, and therefore this is where instances comes in. In this example here, I have two circles next to each other. Now if I want to change the size of one, I now have to go into the other and do the same, remembering what value I changed to for the other. If I then want to change the colour of these circles, again I have to do it twice, once for each. With an instance, as soon as I change any attribute on one circle, it changes onto the other. To create an instance once in the Fusion tab, copy a node with the right click menu or copy shortcut and then paste it as an instance, either in the right click menu by clicking in an empty space on the node area or by using the shortcut. Now that I have this instance, you can see which nodes are linked together by this thin green line that goes between them. At this point, I have my two circles cloned, however, I want to change the positions of these separately. To do this, I can click on the position value in the instance node and select D instance. This removes the link between the values, keeping all other values shared between the two nodes. As you can now see, I can move them independently, but things like scale and colour are still shared. In some more complex projects, you may want more instances of a node, and to do this, just paste more instances. However, remember that when you de-instance a value, you only do that for the single instance, so the other instances will still share the value with the original unless you de-instance it on them too. If a video on the basics of nodes and the Fusion tab is what you need, you can check out this video here in the card.